Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm excited to be sharing Amazon must-haves and favorites. A lot of spring home decor items. I have just even home essentials in here, a mix of some fashion, a little bit of beauty, a little mix of everything in this Amazon favorites. These are always some of my favorite to film and I always um, love sharing them with you guys. So I'll have everything linked below in that description box in case you guys want to check any of it out. I will also try to add it into a comment by your requests um, to share in the comment section as well. I'll pin it right at the top so you guys could easily find everything. And give this video a like if you are loving the Amazon favorites and you guys wanna see more Amazon home or like fashion, let me know by giving this video a like. Okay, let's start off with these faux greenery little potted plants. So here they are right here, but I added this scalloped ceramic pot that I also found from Amazon. So they come like this in a pack of three. So there's three different types of greenery. I don't know all the technical terms of the greenery, but they're all like really pretty. And I believe this one though is eucalyptus, uh, but there's this really pretty one that's very light and airy. And then there's also this one, which is super cute. And I love like the shades of green. They're very soft. They don't really look super, super fake, like a bright lime green sometimes. Like when I see um, potted plants, so these look really realistic and they're really pretty. They, like I said, came in a pack of three. They do automatically come in these like, um, they look like a concrete vibe. For my vibe, it's a little too modern of a vibe for me. So I found these separately. They're a scallop trim, a little ceramic um, pot and it comes in a pack of two. So I actually wanna order another set now that I know I love them. These would be great too if you have real plants to put in them or fake like I have here. Um, if you wanted to even take this a step further, I would put like a little bit of moss at the very top just to like cover up like the interior pot. But other than that, this looks so pretty. Here's how the other one looks in here. And like I said, I just have to get another set for this one. But I think these are really pretty to sprinkle throughout your home, wherever you just need a little something, a little pop of life, like on a console table or a bookshelf. Um, and in so many different rooms, this look pretty like in an office, kitchen, bathroom, like near my kitchen sink, this would look so darling. Got these jars, these are glass jars from Amazon. They come in a pack. And um, here's just one of them. I have the other one downstairs in my kitchen, but um, they're just glass jars. It has a silicone seal in the lid. And I thought this would be perfect. I have been making a lot of different salads for lunches and some of the toppings that I cut up and whatnot would be perfect in this glass jar. Keep it nice and fresh. And also glass obviously is just so much better to have than plastic for your food items. So I'm really excited about these. They come in different sizes too. So I'm really thinking now I'm gonna start to collect these and transform my fridge for all the packaged things instead of keeping them in the plastic bags from the grocery store that everything comes in. It's best to, you know, food prep, chop everything up and then I'm good for the week if it's all in this container. And I think it'll last a lot longer because it's sealed. Okay, let's switch gears a little bit to something really darling and all the Coquette vibes, especially now that Coquette, I've been loving that Coquette is like major right now, even though I've always just loved the Coquette aesthetic. But this is just, I love that it, you're seeing just so much more right now. So I found these darling socks, Oop, just drop one. Um, they're a pack of three. I've shared these on quite a bit of collages in my LTK profile and I finally got them in and you guys are so cute. I just recently ordered them. They didn't take that long to get in, but I've been meaning to order them and then they're so cute. They're a little bit like of a thinner sock. So they're not something like a thick cozy sock by any means, but they're so cute even to wear with sneakers. Like that whole aesthetic looks really nice. And I also just love these even if you wanna lounge in the house or wear them with like loafers or something. I think they're really cute. So you get two different styles of pink with the ditzy floral, and then it comes with the white. So adorable. So like I said, in the three pack, you could also break them up into like little gifts and things. All right, next up is this electric can opener. I'm really excited about this because I actually was in need of one. I don't know ever since my move what happened to my can opener, and then I never really got one because a lot of the cans I had were like a pull tab, but then I recently got some soups that I, um, from Sprouts, and I wanted to have one one day, and I realized I didn't have a can opener. So I ordered one from Amazon. You just press the button once, and then it cuts around. You do have to press it again to stop it. You don't want it to go more than one rotation around, because then it will start shaving the metal from the can. You know, you don't want to do that. So just stop it once, once it gets around, but it just takes batteries, and it's so nice and easy and effortless, it's, especially if you have like even joint pain, 
anything like that. It's so nice to not have to twist a can opener. And this one's just really handy. And also I believe, I have to double check the listing, but I believe it says that it makes the can much more safer to handle. You still want to use caution, but it does make it a little bit safer the way that it cuts the can. Okay, you guys know how much I love my faux florals, my faux greenery around my home. And last springtime I shared these hydrangea, these pink ones, and then also the white ones. So I actually just had to repurchase the pink because I may have told the story in the last one of my Amazon recent videos is that my pink ones I had in my, at my old home, um, I had the flower sitting in an area where it was pure sun. I had no like window treatments in that area. And so they literally just like faded because they were direct sun. Cause that's like where the sun hits the most in, in that house. And so I've learned not to keep these in direct sunlight because the, the colors will fade. Unless you have the white, then you're good. But um, you just want to watch that. So if they're in an area with the pure sun, they, this pink will fade. Um, so I did have to repurchase them because I wanted, you know, a nice like true color pink and because they were like pale pink. Um, but these are so stunning. These are the most realistic faux hydrangeas that I've ever seen. And I've shopped at a lot of different stores that carry faux florals. You wanna say they come detached. So what I mean by that is, I'll set these right here. I have them like in this little scalloped base, but um, I cut them down first of all. So I will link the wire cutters or like their cutting shears that work really well. You definitely don't wanna just use your plain old scissors with this. You wanna use a, like a strong, shear so i will link the ones i actually got from amazon but i do want to add that they these come detached so the leaves could come apart which i've seen some people take their leaves off for an even like they think it looks a little bit more realistic even with the leaves off so you could do them in the vase without the leaves um, i don't mind the leaves i think they look really cute but it comes detached like this so also the top comes off so you just have to assemble it just a little it does come with like a glue stick i think so if you want to like actually have it a little bit more permanent you can do that but i've never had an issue with it coming apart and like i said they feel so realistic and they look so realistic i can't handle how cute they are and they just look so nice so in this face i have i think this is it comes in a set of three stems and i have six stems in this face just so you guys know it's like a medium sized vase and it, it looks really, really nice and full. Okay, here is another faux floral find that I am so excited about. So let's do actually these next because I feel like before we know it's gonna be like Easter time and like full blown spring mode and these faux tulips are so stunning. This is just two packs right here. Um, but I, I realized I have to buy more, but I just wanted to see how they work. But you could even like make them look super realistic like by bending them and you know, tilting them down, like they will bend because there's like a wire in here. So you could really manipulate it to however way you want it to look even more realistic. But if you're doing like an Easter tablescape or just centerpiece for spring in general, and you love tulips, these again, feel and look realistic. I think they're absolutely stunning. They're really darling. Another thing that last both, actually, no, we have two more and you guys, these are so good. So these are like a cabbage rose, I believe, or yeah, I think it's a cabbage rose. These look like kind of like even like a peony, but they're so stunning. Again, they feel, like you guys need to feel these in person. They feel so real, like a waxy feel, like a petal would feel, and it's insane. These are so gorgeous, so again, realistic, um, and they just look really pretty. I'm gonna add these into an existing greenery arrangement that I have, and I think these look really nice. Um, I may even need to buy like one more pack, but they're gorgeous. The last thing of the faux florals, and it's these cherry blossom stems. I love decorating with cherry blossom stems, especially every spring. I just think it is the ultimate, you know, floral for springtime is the cherry blossom. And I found these from Amazon, you guys. Again, sometimes I find some stems and they're just a little too yellow toned. And I think this is the perfect cream cherry blossom. They look so gorgeous. So this is three stems and this is already pretty full. I probably would buy one more pack just to fill out like a medium sized vase, I would say. And I need to cut these down. I'll show you guys like what I plan to do. But just keep in mind, I need to add one more set just to fill it out and it'll look a little bit fuller, but this is three and they look so pretty. Again, you could kind of bend the stems to kind of swag to the side if you want. And it just looks so beautiful in your home for spring. And those stems are pretty long. So you could 
adjust them to what size vase. If you have a larger vase, these would also totally work in a large vase. Um, I wouldn't do a small, I would do like a medium or a larger size vase with those. Okay, I wanna do a beauty tool because this is so, um, this is so helpful for me because if you guys are not cleaning your hairbrushes regularly, you definitely, I definitely suggest doing so because just like how you wash your hair regularly, if you're all your hairbrush is holding in all that dirt, product buildup, pollution, it's all getting in your hairbrush. And so if you're brushing your hair with a brush filled with that, when you just freshly wash it, then it's kind of, you know, defeating the purpose of trying to keep your like hair nice and clean and you know keep the longevity of how long it'll stay clean so you want to try i try personally to like clean my hairbrush as much as possible so i found this tool to just make it so much easier instead of like picking all the hair out what i'll do is i'll take all the hair out of the brush which sometimes can be tough because it like settles at the bottom a little bit and this is like a new brush i'm not gonna show like a hairbrush with hair and i think that would be kind of gross to show on camera but this is just you'd have to just imagine this tool it has like a tough, thick, really coarse bristle. And this just pulls everything out because sometimes I'm like there trying to pick all the hair out. And then what I'll do is I'll just take my shampoo that I use regularly and then suds it up on my Tangle Teaser, which is another Amazon favorite. I've shared this a ton of times, um, but I just thought I'd mention it because this one you could actually get wet on like a lot of other hairbrushes that the water will seep in and get moldy. This will not because there's nothing for the water to get in. So these are like the best kind of hairbrushes to wash. And then, um, yeah, you just clean it. There's also like a little metal tool too to clean out, but I mainly use this side here. Amazing, it's a game changer if you wanna clean your hairbrushes and just make it quicker and easier. Okay, I share this water picture over on my Instagram. I did like an Amazon share week of like all my favorite things for the week. And so I also saved a lot of them too, if you guys are interested on my Instagram profile under Amazon Home. I have a ton of products shared on there that I went throughout my home and showed you guys a lot of my favorites, but this is one of them. And you guys, this was like the most clicked item from the home favorites and you guys have been loving it and I have been loving this. So I have been on the lookout for a good quality water filtration pitcher. Um, like say instead of, as opposed to like say a Brita, I wanted something with glass. So this is a tempered glass container. This also filters out water. I'm gonna put the um, information and specifics about it here. They explain it a lot better, um, but it basically just filters out any microplastics and any contaminants in the water, like just so, like even better than some of the standard filters that you see um, at the store. So I really love this. And I have to say, I, cause I could tell the difference between say like, refrigerated, like even just a regular filtered water, say from a Brita versus if I were to drink like a Fiji or Evian water. If you guys have ever tried Fiji or Evian, you know it's like a smoother taste. It just tastes so smooth, the water. I don't know how to explain it, um, but I just do. I taste the difference. So this reminds me of Evian and Fiji water, and this is hands down like the best tasting water. It also has a silicone bottom, and I will say, Putting on the in the filter for the first time it could be a little tricky, um, but just they have the instructions there, but it's so worth it. And yeah, can't say enough. So I love this thing so much. Okay, let's do a little fashion favorite. And it is this quarter zip. I share this in a recent Amazon fashion haul. And this was one of the top clicked items and this is so buttery soft, this quarter zip. And it's actually one of my favorite brands to shop on Amazon. They have like really nice quality clothes. Like I've had really great experiences with their, like washing all their pieces and they held up really well. But I love this like soft, neutral, striped quarter zip. It just is an easy throw on and go piece with even leggings or jeans. And I love the vibe of it. It kind of is giving like a Varley vibe. So it looks like it should at least be triple the price. And it feels so incredibly soft and luxe. Okay, I wanted to share because I feel like just like with bobby pins that they just randomly disappear, my hair clips disappear. The ones that you use to like pull your hair off your face to do makeup. So I found these neutral ones, which I think are so cute. They come with all of these. So you get them in two separate little acrylic or like plastic containers. So you can even gift a set. Um, that would be cute little to make like in a gift basket or something. Um, but I love these neutral clips. So you basically just clip them up when you wanna, you know, do your makeup. 
or skincare and they just keep your hair off your face and they're really handy. Okay, I am so excited about this other home find. These coasters are adorable. I love this wooden look. I love adding in wooden elements, especially because it just warms up the house because there's a lot of white going on in my house. So I've been trying to add in here and there some things that will warm up the space. So I love these and they have like that scallop kind of flowery look to them. They come in a set of four. They look really beautiful and perfect to have like in your living room or in your kitchen. Um, if you have guests over, I think it's just so nice to have the coasters right there for them. Okay, I have been loving getting my nails done as a treat to myself like about once a month I've been going. I've been doing a French for like the last three or four months, um, but I pretty much always add a bow to my French manicure just for something a little bit different. And I've just been enjoying the like the bows getting their moment right now. I'm like, why not? So I have a pink bow. I think I'm gonna do a white bow the next time I go. But I asked my salon, cause I've seen on some pictures of people's nails like at, on Instagram, like they had like a little pearl in the middle. My salon only had like rhinestones and a little silver ball, which I have on right now. So then I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna look on Amazon. I'll just bring them to my next appointment. So that's what I got and I'm gonna bring them next time I go. And I'll definitely keep you guys posted on how it looks. So I'll, maybe I'll have that on my Instagram first and then maybe I'll update. Even if you do at-home manicures, it would be cute to get these. Just to like kind of elevate your at-home manicures as well. Okay, I should just do this because this has been on my lap. Um, but this is a gorgeous pillow cover that I found from Amazon. So you have to buy the insert separately, but the covers are pretty inexpensive. And you guys, this is giving high-end luxury home decor it's very similar to this for like well over a hundred dollars per pillow cover which is insane um but these are a fraction of the price and they're so pretty this like it's a nice way to add a pop of spring into your home and like i said you could add your own pillow insert i got the inserts from amazon and i love it because you could chop it if you want i just love these so yeah, I'm really excited. It's like a pastel blush pink and has the piping around the edge and it has an invisible zipper, which literally you can't barely even tell it's there. Hence why it's called an invisible zipper. Um, but I just love this thing so much. So I'm excited to add these onto my couch. Okay, I also got this for my kitchen. Like I said, I've been trying to add some warmer elements into my home. So I got this bowl for fruit. So I'm gonna just have corral all my fruit or like even vegetable in here. I thought this was so pretty with the scalloped detailing. And then the bottom is really nice too because it has like a foam bottom so it doesn't scratch your counters. And I just thought this was really pretty and handy just to corral all my fruit into one spot. Okay, I have a fashion favorite and I got these over the winter time, but I wanna share, this is giving like designer-esque vibes. If you've seen the Gucci tights before, um, they're this is like very similar vibe. It's just that it has the C's. I'm not sure if you guys can see, it's kind of hard to show. But see that it just has the C's instead of the G's and they're really really cute and sheer and they look so designer-esque and they're very nice quality. I was like I didn't have any issues with them tearing or anything so far. I've worn them a couple times already. They've been really great so I highly recommend those. Okay I have this letter sorter from Amazon in my office. It's acrylic and it has gold detailing and I thought this was so pretty but also so functional at the same time. I love sorting paperwork or letters or, that I get in the mail, like any bills, all the things that you don't wanna lose on your desk and you know need to be in place. This is really great. So it has four slots and, or you could use it for like outgoing mail or incoming mail that you need to review. So you can make it however it's gonna work best for you, but I really find this handy. Okay, here, I'm gonna hold this up just for a second but I can't hold it for that long because it's actually pretty heavy. It is this doormat and I got this. It, it's not the prettiest doormat, but it's so functional because in my mudroom, so when I enter my house from my garage a lot of the time, um, it, I just want something that's gonna, you know, wipe off any dirt on my shoes and I keep my shoes right at that point for my house that I don't wear, I don't have shoes in my house at all. So I keep any shoes, they stay on the mat and that way everything's in one spot. And so I wanted to, I got like a lighter weight doormat but it's like sliding around and I wanted this heavier duty one and I think that's really great, especially if it's rainy out, it'll just absorb everything. And it's really nice with the diamond quilted pattern. I think it's very just like 
minimal looking. Okay, this is giving Lululemon vibes. I was really excited to find this. This is a dual key pouch. If you guys have seen like the Lululemon ones, they kind of have like a similar vibe, um, but this has like a little wristlet on it. You could also unhook these. So if you have like a D ring in your tote bag, you could also just unhook one of these and pop it right in your bag on the D ring. So then you could put like keys, money, um, cards, anything that you need in here, it'll fit. And it's like perfect and it's nylon, so it's wipeable. And like I said, it comes in pink and this cream color. I believe there was another color. I'll have to double check. But if you click the link, it'll show you the colors that are currently available because I'm not sure if it changes. Um, but yeah, it's so, so cute. I love it. It's very useful and handy. So I'm really excited about that. Okay, and you guys, like I, there's so much good home decor in this video that I'm like, this is very spring vibes. This, this is making me so excited for spring. So I got, well, I first off got these little bow. This is not Amazon, the bow napkin ring holders I got. And then I realized, I'm like, you know what? I really need to find now a really cute set of napkins. And so I found these from Amazon. Um, these are gorgeous with the scallop detail. They come in a pack of four and they have like this tan piping. So I figured it kind of was nice to tie in with the rattan looking napkin rings. And these are just so pretty. Again, for any spring tablescapes that you wanna do or settings, I think these are absolutely beautiful and the napkins are really nice quality. Um, and yeah, they come like this, but here, I'll open one up for you guys. How cute. And these would be perfect for Easter, for any spring celebrations or really any time of year. I think these are really, really pretty napkins. I have to press this set. I just ironed this one so far, but it's so pretty and darling. The most darling tablescape idea. So I love it with the bow. Okay, so that is it for my Amazon favorites. If you guys enjoyed this video and stay till the end, be sure to give it a thumbs up and comment below which videos you guys wanna see for springtime on my channel. I'd love to hear what you guys wanna see. And of course, I'll have everything that I shared linked below. And then I'll also include outfit details. I'll have everything linked in that description box and in comment section for you guys. And that's gonna be it for today's video. I love you all so much and I will see you all in my next video very soon. Bye.